some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video was sent to me by a subscriber of mine, much appreciated, and it takes us to Dallas, Texas, where we have a frauditor who gets himself uh, kicked out of the Health and Human Services office because he wants to be a complete dumbass. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this freaking S show on the road, shall we? That's it. 5455 Blair Road, Texas Health and Human Services Commission. Let's go ahead and see what's happening. And here we go. One room. No recording, sir. Sir! Sir! No recording. And just go around like this, yeah. So let's go. What's up? No I can record, bro. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. This paper's on the wall. I said you can't record. The Constitution say I can. No, you can't. No, you can't, bro. You can't record. I ain't gonna be here long, bro. You can't record, bro. Don't make, don't make a scene, bro. Don't make a scene. Don't embarrass yourself. Most of all, because... Are you sure that's what it says, Frauditor? Because I can guarantee you that it doesn't exactly say that whatsoever. But I do guarantee that there is the Tenth Amendment that grants the states the rights to create laws that are not covered in the Constitution, which brings us to the Texas Trespassing Statute, which can apply in this very situation, you gibbering idiot. Because I can legally do this, man. No, you cannot. Right, I'm trying to tell you, you cannot. You could, I will let you. I don't care, but I can, can't, bro. It's the, it's the rules of the, it's the rules of the government. It might state. be the rules, but it's not against the law. But this is a state office. You I understand that. A state office. Yes, you can, bro. No, you can. I do it all over, bro. This ain't my first time doing this, here. bro. This ain't my first time, brother. You cannot record it, bro. All right, man. All Go get your manager, man, so she can educate you, bro. Now, this dude did all that, man. Next. Everybody talking about I'm recording. Look like, look like we're getting ready to get it on, man. You know, for Auditor, this particular building right here issues food stamps, uh, rent assistance, other government services that people are often embarrassed to ask for. And here you come in with a camera to uh, put them on the Internet to expose them to the world for their, uh, well, embarrassment to begin with. And you want to uh, do this, why? For ad revenue? Yeah, okay. Who's the real jackass around here? It certainly isn't them for uh, asking you to stop filming. Y'all see, I had. Excuse me, sir. When I came in here, I had. Excuse me, sir. You can't record in here. I had. Uh, Excuse I, I can, me, sir. sir. You yes. can't record in here. I can, sir. I didn't know you can't. Don't, don't, no, don't touch no, my camera. Don't touch my camera. Don't you touch me. That wouldn't be your best bet. It, I'm telling you, that's not your best bet. Bruh. You got no, to walk. Bro, you got to I'm walk out of here. Look, I'm not gonna do nothing. We're not gonna do nothing in here. Yeah. But if you touch, but if you touch my camera, we got a problem. We well, we don't have one. But you you can't record it here. Yes, I didn't just tell you that. How can I help you? I'm a supervisor of this place. The way you can help me yes, sir. is tell these gentlemen to fall back. Okay. Because I have a legal Are right. You recording. Yes. As we speak. If you're recording, please don't please stop recording. I, I request to you. I don't have to, sir. <laughs> Legally, I don't have to. You think I just came I in here? We, Do you uh, think I just... Hold on, I want to make this one point. Do you think that I came in here 
and going to argue with y'all and don't know what the hell I, I'm I, talking I, about. I, well, is that a, a rhetorical question? Because in reality, uh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. Many frauditors don't know what the hell they're talking about. And uh, you are definitely in that camp of people who don't know what the hell they're talking about and never will know what the hell they're talking about. So uh, go get yourself educated, you black brain moron. Give you the number of that person. You can speak to them, if you, but you cannot record, you know. All right. I'm sorry. All right. All right. All right. Sir, that's just a sign. That's not the, the law. I'm not breaking the law. What's your name, sir? What's my name? What's your name? My name is Mirza Big. I'm a supervisor here. My name is Benny, and I don't want to be in it. Miss Benny. Benny, Benny. Yeah, Benny, Mr. Benny. How do you spell it? However you think it's spelled. I, I request you to stop recording immediately, please. Sir, if y'all leave me be, I'll be out of here in about five minutes. I'll be out of your hand five minutes. I'm doing what I'm doing. I'm legally can, can do what I'm doing. If you leave me alone, because we're wasting time. Why, I could have been why, why gone. Why are you recording it? We, just, why am I recording it? Yes, because I have a constitutional right. It's called the First Amendment right to okay. free press. Ah, you're from the Looney Lana division of uh, frauditors, huh? The kind of frauditors that uh, think that uh, freedom of the press actually means that you have the freedom to go anywhere you want. That freedom of the press means that you have extra rights above anybody else. Well, I'm here to tell you, dude, that's not what it means. It basically means that you can publish your stories without government interference. And that comes from a time when the royal families of Europe were uh, smashing printing presses and making sure that people weren't printing any unfavorable stories about them. That's what that means, you dipshit. Okay, I'm not walking in here knowing what I'm not talking about. You can call the police, you can do all that. You call the police, they're going to tell you. I'm not coming in here doing all this here and I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Okay, Trust and believe I, I that. I personally request you, as you know, that please do stop recording. Okay. You ain't heard nothing I said. You I the police will be called. Sir, so, you know what? I just, you know what I do? I expose tyrants. I did what I, I did what I wanted to do. Your face would be all on TV for being a tyrant. That's for sure. That's for sure going to happen. I have no problem with that. I don't want no problem. I have no problem with But I know what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm asking you to leave. Okay, ma'am. Y'all have a nice day. So you see they made all that howling, screaming, and they made all that fuss telling me that I can't record in there when we all know that I can. Ah, I cry like Snoopy. Ah. <clears throat> we all know that I can. Here he comes again. I'm leaving. I'm leaving, and they and these two brothers come. They 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 don't put your hands on me, bro. Don't put your don't put your hands. Hey, check this out. Damn this number. Forget about that. Tell your people don't put your hands on me because I ain't put my hands on nobody. Okay, okay, bro. All the more threats, bro. Just because you just because you bigger than me don't mean you gonna win, bro. Okay, so I don't either. Like, real talk. Like, I don't either. We can take to the streets. So I want to go. You hey, want to go? Whatever you want to do. What's up in the streets? Go on here. Break your shit out right now. Go ahead on, bro. Real nigga shit, bro. You a hoe. You a hoe and you lose your job. Go ahead. Yeah, right, Frauditor. Uh, I don't think your little motor mouth right there would be uh, any match for his uh, powerful fists, if you know what I mean. In fact, I think your motor mouth would be broken after that. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. If you was really going to do it, you wouldn't let him hold you back. What's that? <laughs> Y'all see that? Hey, so anyway, family, y'all see what just transpired in now. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about a whole, we talk, we're talking about a whole center, a whole center of tyrants. Their ass gonna be on TV, though. We're talking about a whole center of tyrants. But anyway, 
Hey, I hope y'all enjoyed that one, because I did. I like it when it's like that. You know, Frauditor, there's an old saying, if you encounter an asshole, then you've encountered an asshole. If you encounter assholes everywhere you go, then there's a distinct possibility that you might be the asshole. Now, you just said you encountered a building full of tyrants, so the same thing applies to you. If you encountered a building full of tyrants, then there's a distinct possibility that you may be a tyrant because you were trying to throw your weight around in there and, and to hell with everybody else in there. Yeah, think about that one, Frauditor. Why don't you think about the irony of your little statement right there? So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?